Good morning, my friends. I hope everybody's doing well today. I had an interesting conversation with some folks yesterday. One is an older fellow who was raised in Texas. He was one of 10 children. And the other is a beautiful woman who has a 14-year-old son and a 12-year-old daughter. And we got to talking about how it feels to us like we've discontinued or we haven't passed along the importance of values-based living in our country. There's a lot of chaos, it feels like, to us in the country. We got to talking about the use of devices and our attachment to social media, whether it's Facebook, Instagram, Spotify, TikTok, there's probably a half a dozen or more that I don't even know about. And so that's my question to all of us today. Is your device, whether it's an iPhone, a computer, a tablet, an iPad, holding you prisoner because you spend an inordinate amount of time on social media? And you can check this on your devices. Your phone records how much time you spend on all of these apps. So my question to you is, can we be honest with one another? Can we just have an straightforward, vulnerable, honest conversation about how much time we spend on social media. And I understand it is useful in many ways. It's particularly useful when it comes to marketing and educating people about the businesses that you're in and sharing valuable information. I'm all for that. However, I'm curious to know how much of the time that you spend on social media is mindless trolling and going through and just looking at what's there. And I think it's brilliant if you put something funny or you put a family photo or something that really has meaning to you to share with people. I like that a lot. A lot of my friends do that and I look forward to seeing those. However, I'm curious to know how much of a prisoner you've become to the likes of Facebook, Instagram, and other apps that seem to get their claws in us. And I'm curious to know what you're gonna do about it. And if you give yourself a break from it now and then. So let me know in the comments. I'm really interested in this because I think it's an important conversation. I think it's important, especially for our young kids out there who are getting addicted because if you watched the documentary called Social Dilemma, these apps are designed to be addictive. And I've done a lot of reading and a lot of research on the effects it has on our brains as adults and particularly on the brains of young kids. And it's not good. The research has shown that it is not good. So let's have a conversation about it. Tell me where you are with it. Do you discipline yourself and your family to put your phones away and sit down and have dinner together and have a conversation? Do you make sure that your phone as well as your children's phones are in your bedroom under, in a drawer or something at night so they're not tempted to grab their phones and, and get on during the night? I think it's a, it's a very important and pertinent conversation to have. So let me know. I'm curious to get your input. And as always, keep your ass in the saddle, have a kick-ass rest of the day, and I'll talk to you really soon. Take a care.